guys, by the way, kung nakikita nyo itong parang medyo may nakapatong chan, ito ay isang patch from CauseRx also. So, ito yung, ito yung ginagamit ko ngayon na patch. Um, at... Welcome back to my channel. My name is Cherise and for today's vlog, I'll be sharing you about the products that I'm using right now. These products are Korean products. So these are the products that I'm using right now from CauseRx, the Low pH Good Morning Gel Cleanser and the Salicylic Acid Daily Gentle Cleanser. I've been using this one, this Low pH Good Morning Gel Cleanser for almost, not almost, for one month already and this one is only a week pa lang. Week, uh, one week ko pa lang siya ginagamit. And so, unahin ko to since ito, ito yung una kong ginamit. So, low pH good morning gel cleanser is formulated with botanical ingredients. And this is super mild acidic cleanser. Their claim here on their packaging is formulated with purifying botanical ingredients. This low pH formula works to soothe, refresh, and soften the skin without the stripping feeling. So, super favorite ko tong low pH good morning gel cleanser na to. Super konting amount lang yung ilalagay mo. Marami na siya. Parang sobrang uh, enough na para mag para i-cleanse yung face mo. And yung amoy niya naman is medyo may pagka tea tree. Kapag gumag gumagamit ka ng tea tree or tea tree oil, ganun yung amoy niya. Pero sa umpisa lang yun. And masasanay ka na lang along the way na paggagamit mo ng skincare. And this is also helps to treat acne or any breakouts na meron. Lalo na kung if you have sensitive skin, this is really, really good for you and you are suffering for acne and pimples or any sebum. It, it can help your skin to soothe and relax. Lalo na kapag uh, medyo, alam mo yun, nagbe-breakout ka talaga. This is really good cleanser. A mild cleanser na pang-treat ng acne pimples and acne mas. I am using this every morning. Bihira ko lang siyang gamitin sa night. Siguro ginamit ko to ng thrice pa lang sa gabi. Pero mas, for me, mas ideal siyang gamitin sa morning. So, yeah, this is my favorite. Kung tatanungin nyo ako kung magpo-purchase pa ako, yes, magpo-purchase pa ako next time because this, this is really good for my skin. Like, parang first time ko talaga makakita na, alam mo yung nag-exfoliate siya, in-exfoliate niya yung skin mo in a mild, mild way. Super mild way. So, this product is a yes. And yeah, I will gonna purchase this again kapag naubos siya. And super dami na, super dami na. And matagal ko na tong magagamit. Tagal to bago maubos. So, and I think this is really great product and amazing product. And hindi siya ganun ka-pricey to, to treat an acne or pimples or kapag tinitreat mo yung breakouts mo. This product is really a yes. And hindi naman siya ganun ka-expensive para hindi natin, para hindi natin itry. So, if you are are looking for a mild cleanser i can recommend you this and the next one is the salicylic acid daily gentle cleanser so since two weeks ko pa lang to nag nagagamit pero i think um yeah masasabi ko din na this is gentle pero medyo mas harsh lang siya hindi naman siya yung super harsh mild lang siya pero Pano daw? Pero, ano siya eh, parang mapapansin mo kasi pagka nilagay mo sa skin mo, kapag nilather mo siya sa skin mo, super, ano siya, parang, alam mo yung feeling na nag-exfoliate ka, nag-scrub ka ng face mo. Ganon yung, ganon yung, ano, yung pakiramdam kapag, ka, ang tawag dito, nilalagay mo, nilalather mo siya. And parang, may foamy effect siya. Pero hindi siya foam cleanser, parang lang. And uh, salicylic acid, this is really good also on our skin to clean our pores deeply, to take the dirt out all over our face. And super, um, ako ah, may honest review on this, parang talagang pinipil niya kasi yung mga dead skin or dry skin, which is really good naman, pero... Um, sa akin, I have dry and sensitive skin. So, kapag ginagamit ko to araw-araw, mas lalong magiging dry yung surface ng face ko. Kasi, inner, sa surface ng face, sa surface, sa, sa ibaba ng face ko, super dry. Pero pagdating sa ilalim, it's oily. So, ang hirap, ang hirap, ang hirap i-balance. Kaya, minsan, alternate ko siyang ginagamit. Kasi napansin ko, kapag tuloy-tuloy na puro salicylic acid sa gabi, gabi ko lang kasi ito ginagamit. Never ko tong ginagamit sa morning. Okay. 
I never ko tong ginagamit sa morning, sa gabi lang. Kasi super ganda niya, lalo na kapag nag-wear ka ng makeup. And then, super mafe-feel mo talaga na, mafe-feel mo talaga na, alam mo yun, na-exfoliate talaga yung skin mo. And kapag guma gumamit na ako ng ganito sa gabi, hindi na ako nagsascrub. Kasi parang feeling ko, ano, so sobra na yung, parang maso masasobrahan na yung pag exfoliate ng face ko. At I think hindi maganda yung sa skin. So, um... Kung papipiliin mo ako sa dalawang to, they have their own beauty when it comes to working through our skin. Pero, mas mag ako dito kaysa dito kasi parang I have a sensitive skin eh, pero medyo na ha-harshan. Medyo na ha-harshan. Medyo natatapangan ako dito. Kaya, ginagamit ko siya thrice a week lang or minsan uh, alternate. Uh, kunyari, Monday gagamitin ko sa Tuesday, hindi, Wednesday, hindi. So, ganun lang yung gina ginagawa ko na lang dito. Pero, good siya for treatment. Kapag may mga acne ka or like feeling mo parang super, uh, you need to exfoliate, this is really good. Talaga, sobrang, parang bibigyan ka niya ng glass effect eh, na skin. Pero, um, kapag everyday, I can't recommend this. Kasi, sa akin lang ha, kasi parang I have sensitive skin. So, kung hindi ka naman masyadong sensitive, try mong gamitin. And, yeah, let me know in the comment section below. So, these are the products that I'm using right now. So, soon I'll be updating you guys kung ano yung naging, mas, mas naging okay ba to, or ito, mas, paano ba, yung along the way, ano yung naging result pa lalo ng, it, ng salicylic and ng low pH good morning gel cleanser. So, this is for treatment only sa akin na. This is only for treatment and this is, I can use this as my daily cleanser in the morning so yeah i hope you guys learned something about these products and let me know in the comment section below if you have questions or any comments according to these products kapag na try nyo na please kindly comment down below and turuan nyo ako kung may mga may mga tips kayo dyan or any suggestions so thank you so much for watching this vlog and please don't forget to like share and subscribe on my channel and yeah hit the notification bell button down below for you guys to get updated when i posted a new video bye and guys by the way kung nakikita nyo tong parang medyo may nakapatong dyan ito ay isang patch from CauseRx also so ito yung ito yung ginagamit ko ngayon na patch um, acne pimple master patch so lately naman hindi, hindi talaga ako mapimple pero uh, dahil sa weather dito sa Canada nagkaka break out sa ko so um, my friend just introduced me this acne pimple master patch which is really really good pero gamitin mo lang to kapag uh, yung pimple mo ay super hinug na wow hinug na tag-ani na ganun so ilalagay mo lang siya kasi kung yung pimple mo wala pang hindi pa nagpapakita yung parang white yung yung mata niya hindi hindi siya effective like hindi siya hindi lalabas hindi hindi kapag tinanggal mo hindi lalabas yung yung parang mata niya pero kapag um, nakikita mo na yung parang may white na ganun oh doon ka lang maglagay para hindi sayang so yun lang